The representative of the Kurdistan Exchange Companies Association says that the central bank has not yet supported travelers at the region's airports by providing dollars at the official rate, despite its promise to license exchange companies and its call on the Trade Bank of Iraq to open branches at Erbil and Soleimaniya airports, but it is late and may take more than a year to implement, warning of the impact of this on the stability of exchange rates throughout Iraq. More than three years ago, the central bank promised to license exchange companies in the Kurdistan region to provide dollars to travelers. Last hatch season, the seats allocated to the Kurdistan provinces exceeded 4,500 pilgrims, and they did not receive any dollars, which forced them to resort to the parallel market and buy dollars at high prices. In its letter No. 98302 dated 6-30-2024, the Central Bank of Iraq called on the Trade Bank of Iraq to open branches at Erbil and Soleimaniya airports. This procedure highlights two points, the central bank's lack of interest in the long period of time that the bank may take to open the required branches, which may reach a year and a half in the best of cases. The delay in licensing exchange companies in Kurdistan that have long met integration requirements, exacerbating the shortage of dollars for travelers in the provinces. If the central bank wants to find quick and radical solutions, there are many measures that can be implemented in less than two months, but the question remains about why they are dealing in this way with vital files that affect the stability of exchange rates in Iraq.